What are you going on about? No, 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 don't play coy with me. I'm talking about Catherine. You saw her, didn't you? I saw her? Um, excuse me, Don't but... fuck with me, old man! I am serious! Hey! Hey, Vincent! Everyone else said that they didn't see her. And don't you think it's crazy that only you did? You're the one that's crazy. Me? See her? Because of her, I'm starting to lose it. I already know that you're the key. Damn it, why didn't I realize it sooner? Come on, cut it out! <laughs> You saw her! I know you saw her! Speak up! Stop moaning and answer me, goddammit! Vincent! Fuck! <coughs> Just... say something. Please, man. Please. Tell me that you saw her! Well, very well. <coughs> if you must persist. Yes, I did indeed see her. She was blonde, wearing a provocative white dress, like lingerie. Yeah, 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 that's the girl. And you saw her with me yesterday, right? Yes, of course. It's your preference, isn't it? <laughs> Girls like her. So then, you admit it. All right. See? He did see her. <sighs> Jesus. Really? You are just full of surprises. Not only did you survive this long, but to think you figured me out. Huh? I must commend you for your perception. Uh, well, I didn't really perceive anything. And sorry about the choking. A lot happened, so I was a bit freaked out. <sighs> Tell me you didn't see her. There is no way she does not exist. <laughs> well, normally that is the case. Normal people can't see her after all. <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> Wait, what? That's only natural. After all, she isn't from this realm. Boss? It was rather unnatural, wasn't it? <laughs> a girl like her in a town like this? <laughs> Either way, you don't need to worry. <laughs> I have given up on showing you nightmares. Showing me nightmares? It was quite a sight, watching you run like the wind. Uh, what are you talking about? Huh? She was here, right? Her. Catherine. Huh? Uh, wait, you didn't rush me because... I just... I just wanted proof that she really existed. I knew that you saw her. You did, right? Ah. Uh, I see. Ah. Uh. Hey. <clears throat> the usual, sir. Rum and cola, was it? Hey, boss. Can I ask you something? Uh, what would that be? You see, I thought that nightmares were something that you see on your own. So could it be... that... That... That someone else can show you one? Well, I... I, I wonder... Come on. Uh, well, I, I wonder... I wonder my ass. Pretty sure I just heard you say you're somehow involved in this. Uh, did I? You heard him, right? Huh? Uh, yeah, he did. So what was that all about? Huh? Well, uh, what did I say? You were surprised I survived? What does that mean? I didn't say that. You said it. I didn't say it. Stop fucking with me! I know that you're hiding something! Tell me! I don't know. Why do I have to go through all this shit? Well, it's not just you. Excuse me, I was not expecting this turn of events. Fuck you! Every day is unexpected for me! And what is with these fucking shades? You are indoors! Who the fuck are you? Please, stop. You're dealing with a desperate man now. Thanks to you and your bullshit, Catherine and I are through. So explain yourself, you fucking monster! 
Allow me to introduce myself. I, Thomas Mutton. Okay, okay. Uh, to sum it up, when there are people like you who spend a long amount of time with a partner without commitment, it impedes the population model. The rate of population growth is less than optimal. What the hell are you talking about? So, I have these hesitant gentlemen climb that. Wait, you're talking about the nightmare? Oh, you're the one behind that? Who... who the hell are you? I have been given many names by humans since ancient times. Wasting a woman's time of greatest fertility is a hindrance to the future of the species. So we separate these non-fruitful couples and redistribute the women to men who can follow the natural order, you see? Okay, so what? You're just killing men who have a partner that they don't want to marry? Is that it? Well, to put it bluntly... You think I'm gonna accept your bullshit story? Please do not worry. You won't see that young girl ever again. Huh? She is a succubus. She appears at will and seduces men under the curse by appearing as their ideal woman. If you're going to sever ties with a longtime partner, what better way than with a messy affair, right? Oh, man. <sighs> Do you understand everything now? <laughs> yeah, I get it. I get everything. So, in the end, what am I guilty of? Uh... <laughs> if the girl doesn't exist, then it's not cheating. <sighs> if it feels like cheating, then it's cheating, right? You think... <laughs> you think you can just get away with this? Uh, well, it isn't like I just started this job yesterday. After all, the reason you were born was because we weeded out the man who was misleading your mother. <laughs> I do believe that was the case. You better stop fucking with me. If you don't wish to believe, that's fine. However, it is a necessary evil. <sighs> Having a broken heart may be painful, but you have also earned your freedom. Plus, you have a fierce will to survive. You should be able to grasp happiness again soon enough. To me, she... she was already family. I only realized that after I was dumped. How pathetic is that? I really can't help you there. This entire situation is your fault, right? So what are you gonna do about it? Huh? What? You're the one who cheated. Now, how is that my fault? Well, it sure as shit isn't mine. You're the cause of it all. Plus, I was ready to get married. You got your wish. Uh, but that was only due to your cheating on her, right? Besides, it's too late to make up with her now. You don't get to decide that. If you really intend to push me, tonight I will have to show you what I can really do. If that happens, then tonight will certainly be your last. Are you prepared to die? Prepared to die? What if you die here before I do? Vincent! Hey, wait a second. <laughs> Yo, you still alive? We came back since we're worried about you. Let's drink some more, man. Wouldn't be able to sleep anyway. I didn't have any problem sleeping. Uh, hey, something happened? Uh, guys, Boss and Vincent are... It's okay, don't say anything. Uh, but... What's wrong? Uh, sorry, I, uh, I haven't finished my chat with him yet. You guys start the party without me. Whatever you say, just don't go aggro, you drunk. Ah, don't worry, we're just, just playing some games here. <laughs> right? Yes, that's right. <laughs> There's no point screwing around with you. I'll let you off. For now. But in return... About what you were saying? If I am still alive tomorrow, you're gonna grant me my wish. Wait, Vincent. 
What are you saying? I'm telling you, it's impossible. Then you should have no problem making that promise. If you really can control the nightmares, then make this one the last. It will be the last, whether you win or lose. Not just for me, everyone else. It ends tonight. And not only that, you're going to arrange to have Catherine meet me here. That's impossible. Well, I can't do it. I can't call her, and it's not like I can just text her. <sighs> Very well. If you agree, then I honor your conditions. Really? Great. And remember, you better keep your promise. Got it? Oh, hey, Vincent. Are you sure about this? One week of this bullshit is more than enough. And sorry to make you worry back there, but I gotta end this. Not so much with this jackass, but with myself. What's with him? Acting all badass. So wait, boss, you said... <gasps> what, boss? Eh bah, punaise, pour rester poli. <rire> quel bordel Mais quel bordel Hey, what are you talking about, guys? Maybe when you're older, kid. Hey, that's mean. Oh, are we gonna have that damn dream again tonight? Are you all right? Man, you know I love you. Don't say stuff like that. <laughs> okay. Hey, Vincent. What was that just now? We saw you grabbing Boss. Something happened? No, everything's fine. Sorry you had to see that. Now, I'm not gonna stick my head into every bar brawl you get into, but if something's bothering you, let us know, okay? When we were younger, we'd always help each other as a team. Remember? Yeah. Felt like we could take on the world back then. Fun times. Uh, but Toby here wouldn't know about that, would he? Come on, why you gotta go there? We were like that once, huh? Anyway, we've already settled things. Maybe it's because I'm tired, but the sake is getting to me really quickly. Hey, don't overdo it. Let's have some good stuff tomorrow. What do you mean? Um, nothing. Huh? You got mail. De qui ça peut être? Ah bah oui. Pour dire que j'ai fini le niveau 8, évidemment. Chief and Orlando aren't looking too good. Everything will be okay after tonight. Which means... Never mind. Well, I'll be back to normal come tomorrow. I'll bet my life on it. Uh, what do you say? Hey, don't look at me like I've lost it. Can a guy try to sound cool sometimes? You haven't had any nightmares, have you? You mean that one in the rumors that are supposed to kill you? <laughs> yeah, I'm not that gullible. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> it's cool, then. You got mail. Bon, et c'est qui cette fois Problème de PJ. À Monsieur Vincent Brook. Certains de nos tout derniers modèles de téléphone mobile ont des difficultés à accéder à notre service de stockage en ligne. Nous vous prions de nous excuser pour la gêne occasionnée. Pour résoudre le problème, nous renvoyons à nos clients les données qu'ils stockaient en ligne par SMS, et ce, sans surcoût. <rire> Okay. This takes me back. This takes me back. 
Ah, il y en a. Il y en a qu'une, ok. Bon, qui est-ce qu'il y a dans le bar Ah tiens Toujours vivant, lui. Tant mieux This is when the mass media shines. But I'm too afraid to write about it. I think it's because I'm afraid to admit that I have the power to save people through my words. Yeah, well, I'll look forward to whatever you write. Think I can get an interview with you one day? The unnamed hero? <laughs> Stop it. It's embarrassing. It's all because of you. Thank you. It's the unadulterated truth. After this is all over, <laughs> I'm gonna marry my girlfriend. I should buy the ring so I can do it the moment I'm ready. C'est mignon. Today's lead story is the mysterious weakening deaths. James Thompson, age 33, was found dead today. Was he in the nightmare too? Were we climbing together? And George Baker, age 30. Once again, the names of the deceased. Mm. Je vois pas qui c'était. C'est pas grave. Figured out who the witch is. Really? And who is it? It was me. <laughs> you know all that shit that went on when we were young? Seems it got mixed in with the rumors. Well, you did disappear that one time. And to think I just kept spreading the rumor, fooling people. Was there anyone who believed it? You. Well, I never believed it in the first place. Listening to you never leads to anything good. What? Anyway, about what you and Boss were talking about? Dumbass. It's all a lie. Don't worry about it. Tomorrow we can drink and enjoy ourselves. Okay. I hope so. Hey, how much of what you were talking about tonight is true? You said you'd be fighting? <laughs> you really never change, do you? True or not, I don't think I can lose to him. This is the end. For the mysteries, the rumors, for the guys, and for everyone. He needs to take responsibility. Look, just don't be stupid about it, okay? Everyone's worried about you. <laughs> I'll be fine, don't worry. Come back here tomorrow, okay? Have a drink. Ah, tiens. <laughs> You've got your game face on. Sign of a great man. Yeah. I have something I have to finish. I know you. You're probably doing something that isn't worth the reward. It's nice of you to help us out when you've got your hands full already. You guys? Yeah. I know. You saved me. I see. Guess what? I think I'm gonna get married and start a family. I've always secretly dreamed of loving somebody. Of being loved. Me too. I'm gonna start over with my wife. Great. I think I can be a real man now. And come out of my father's shadow. Hey, dude. I'm gonna keep living my life, too. It's all thanks to you. Thank you. I'm grateful. Hey, let's change the subject. It's embarrassing. You never know who might be listening. Even walls have ears these days. <laughs> what are you talking about? I've got to apologize about your wife. Ah, I'm not listening. Everyone makes mistakes. And everyone has the right to start over. Boss. I'm turning my life around in so many ways. It's all thanks to you. I'm grateful too. Thank you. J'ai <rire> j'ai comme l'impression que je les avais jamais sauvés dans mes anciennes parties ces deux-là. Vu que je viens d'avoir deux trophées. Enfin, je savais encore leur parler ou pas, j'ai pas fait attention. Non. Faudrait que je regarde les trophées après. Ah tiens, les deux petites vieilles sont parties. 
On va se saouler. Exactly what it sounds like. A cock's tail. Why is it called that? No clear etymology exists for the word, but here's a famous story. A long time ago, an English sailor asked a young Mexican boy stirring alcohol in a glass what the name of the liquor was. The boy thought he was asking about the name of the stirring stick, so he answered, Cola de Gallo, a cock's tail feather. This is said to have spread as the name of mixed drinks in general. <laughs> Isn't that interesting? But who knows what's true? Since you have had at least one cocktail a night and learned fascinating facts, you will now be given the title of Cocktail Connoisseur. And that was all of the trivia on cocktails. Please continue to enjoy the rest of the story. Empty? Erica, I need a drink. So nothing too fancy, okay? Ah tiens, encore un trophée que j'avais pas, décidément. <rire> euh, je vais prendre une bière. Sake, please. I'll take a beer. Beer. Mm -hmm. Here you go. Don't get shit faced, all right? Boss is in here, so it's all on the house. Ooh, I like the sound of that. Ok. Est-ce que j'ai encore quelque chose à faire Nope. du tout cette fois. Ok, bon ben... Bah. Je crois qu'on peut y aller. J'ai plus personne à qui parler. Euh... Je suis bien bourré. <rire> On va pouvoir partir d'ici, j'imagine. Je fais un dernier petit tour au cas où. Non, c'est bon. On peut y aller. I don't got the time to be worrying about money. Something more important than cash. <rire> Are you going home, Vincent? Ouais. Don't look so worried, Erica. You'll be okay. Have some faith in me. See me tomorrow. Okay. I believe in you. See you soon then. 